Well, hello, hello, ladies and gentlemen. Today we have a special video for you guys. Because today, we are going to rate Squeak in both sides. You all know the rules. We are only allowed to play two solo matches and two duo matches. And after that, we rate them. So let's, let's begin. One thing that you guys might have noticed, he's not at power 10. So um, I might do part two when I do get him to power 10 funny because I'll, I'll create I'll create maybe like 42 32 and that's um yeah, it's just hilarious Definitely, definitely can get pushed by other brawlers. Like, you can definitely get pushed. So, he, um, you're, you're getting pushed by these brawlers hard. And his health, I mean, his health is decent, but it's a little bit lower than the other ones. And his damage, his range really doesn't, I don't know. The only thing I had to say is Squeak would be good, and in Solo Showdown, you gotta stay safe. You definitely push him, but you gotta stay safe. So let's try Duo Showdown. Now this is a really hard one because, like, people will be teamed up with random. Because, let's all be honest, I don't want to just go through hundreds and hundreds of ballers. Let me see which one's our first. If you wanted me to do one, I'd just do the perfect combo. The like button, but still, and that's not that's not what I'm going to do. I'm just trying to read. So I'm actually getting teamed up with the person that's going to me. One thing is, is you have to have a direct hit to actually get guaranteed damage. You have a chance uh, of getting damage, but you don't have a guaranteed damage. And you can actually do one corner. Those bombs are so thin that they're actually able. And you can actually have to get double the damage. Like you can have, you can get two people at once. It's actually really cool. But I think that's only in 3D females. I don't test 3D females. That was a stupid play. I'm dead. That was a really stupid play by me. Got in my back. Anyway, um, let's try one more time. So, he, he, he really does not have a lot of health. Other brawlers, like M, like other brawlers, really do, do have higher health than him. The only brawlers that really have lower health are a lot, but it, it, it just doesn't come in to like... OP in this mode. You can probably rate it to a hundred if not. Um so overall, what are we gonna give this um brawler? 
We don't, we don't have much time here. We're already at, like, five minutes. Um, let's just talk about, like, his offense. I really think they raised him wrong. Maybe his attack is, is better. But I don't think that that comes in. And he really looks too slow. And the only way I think would be good in 3v3 mode. I mean, Lex even said it himself. Don't take him into showdown. Because... Well, the same reasons apply. He's not he's not good at health. And his damage is good, but he doesn't he has to take a wide area up to get that guaranteed damage. Like he can have nine people in the same like like area and he'll get all that damage. Some that's impossible, but still, it, it is it's weird. It's weird. And Especially with a sticky bomb, he can get how many people? Three short blows with his three bomb of three ten six. He can get six people if they're spread out. And especially this, if we do the calculations here, um, one sec, I have to do the calculations here. If you somehow get all the bombs on one thing, one thousand two hundred fifty times six. That's 7,500 damage, not even to mention that I'm not even power 10 yet. This damage could be from 7,500 to 9,000, maybe even 10,000. So it, it, it's really, it's, he's really a good brawler in 3v3 modes. Like, take him into heist, take him into gem grab, take him into any other one, but... I don't think you guys should take him into not into solo showdown. You can. Do you have a risk of dying like a lot? Definitely keep that in mind when you're playing solo showdown or duo showdown. Anyway, that's my rating for him. I give him like a, a six because well you can't get him with okay, no, no, no. Re reset that. I'm giving him a three. I would play him, but I have to downgrade him significantly. Just kidding with the six. You, you thought. I give him a six because, well, yeah, he doesn't have all the 3v3 modes. While he basically has a wider radius than other brawlers, he can definitely take a punch. I think I'd honestly... I I would give him a five, but the thing is, is that he can really... Do, he, he's great in all the other modes. I mean, compared to M's, like, yeah, she has, like, the ho most health and most damage. But if you take her into other modes, like, let's say, like, Brawl Ball, or Knockout, even, you're gonna have that risk. And Jesse, especially, is risky. I'll do a part two of, of, of Sleep, if you guys want. Um, just because he's not my power 10 brawler. Anyway, guys, I hope y'all have a great day. I might, I hope you guys are all subscribed so you know when I post. Cause, well, it's hard to know when people post. Anyway, um, see you later.